My name is Sarah. I'm a certified diabetes educator. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to give insulin using an insulin pen. First you need to gather your supplies, which would be the insulin pen itself, an alcohol swab, and the pen needle. Then you want to wash your hands with soap and water or use an alcohol sanitation solution. Rub your hands together until it's dry. Start by removing the cap to the pen. At this point, if you have cloudy insulin, which would include NPH insulin or a mixture thereof, you want to mix it. You mix it with your palms, like rolling it together, or you can go gently back and forth. You don't want to rigorously shake it. If you have clear insulin that does not contain NPH, then you, can, you don't, don't have to mix. You can skip that part altogether. Use your alcohol wipe to wipe the rubber membrane on the end of the pen. And then remove the protective tab on the pen needle. Push the needle into the end of the pen and turn it clockwise to tighten it. Next, you want to do what we call a safety check to make sure there's no air in the system. You'll dial the dose indicator to two units. Remove the outer needle cap and save that for later. The inner needle cap you can remove and throw away. So you've dialed to two units. You're going to push on the injector button and watch the end of the needle to make sure that you see some insulin come out. It might be a stream or it might be just drops of insulin. As long as you see liquid there, you know that there's no air in the system. Next, you're going to dial the dose that's been prescribed for you. For example, if five units is my dose, I'll dial to the mark right between the four and the six. And I'm ready to give it. The preferred site for insulin administration is the abdomen. The abdomen is from your rib cage to your hips and as far laterally as you can comfortably reach. You want to rotate sites so that you're not returning to the same couple places again and again. You should be about two finger widths away from your belly button. So first expose the injection site. Hold your pen like a, like a writing pen or a dart. And then you want to go straight into the skin. You can use the other hand if you wish, or the same hand, to push on the injector button. And just, you'll feel it and see it rotate as, it, as it's injected. And then once you've injected the entire solution, hold it for 10 seconds or count to 10 before removing the needle. When you're done, you want to dispose of that pen needle in a puncture-proof container a coffee can, a detergent bottle, a prescription bottle, something that's puncture proof and has a lid. You'll put the protective cap on and turn counterclockwise to remove the needle. Lastly, you want to make sure the pen cap gets back on to protect the insulin from the light.